So I, I picked up this, um, the Ninja Blender, the Auto IQ, um, at Sam's Club the other day because I broke my blender, my fruit processor, and I had a magic bullet, and that burnt out on me as well. And I needed to replace all three, and I did not want to individually replace all three. So I thought this is a good way to do that because they had my blender, a fruit processor, and also um, and the individual where I can take and go. So let's see what's in here. Oh, by the way, um, here's some information. So it's a 1500 watt motor base with the auto IQ, um, has the 72 ounce blender pitcher, um, with the 64 ounce liquid, uh, capacity. Um, then a 64-ounce food processor, chopping blade, dough blade, 24-ounce, two 24-ounce regular cup, a jumbo multi-serve 32-ounce cup, uh, one pro extractor blade, three sip and seal lids, three silicone sleeves, um, instruction booklet. So what I'll do, let me open this up and see if I can get in here. Um, this is what this looks like. Um, we can do salads, um, drinks, adult drinks, yum. Um, um, also some healthy juices. The reason I was looking for something like this because um, starting of January of this year, um, I've been watching what I've been eating. I've been losing some weight, um, exercising, and eating right. I'm not calling it a diet. I'm calling more of a life-size change. Because I know if I call it a diet, I will crash and burn. <laughs> so I'm trying to, you know, take it one day at a time and make the right food choices for myself. So far, I've, I'm down um, 12 pounds, I believe. Um, I only weigh myself once a week, and it's usually on Friday um, in the morning, the first thing I get up. So um, this is just the instruction booklet. Um, let's see what else is in here. Let's see if I can do this with one hand. So this is box one. Box two. Let me move this so I can set the stuff down. Oh, that one's really heavy. I don't know if I can pull it out myself. Okay. I may have to ask my son to help me hold a camera a while. Clifton? Can you hold my camera while I um take these out the box? Because I can't do it by myself. Okay. Let me set the box to the side. stuck in there together okay so I'll set this box up move that out of the way a little bit okay and um let's continue let's see what I got okay so this look like this is the base oh this is awesome I'm excited so this is what the front looks like um got several options the on and off the I can puree some food um I like to make a lot of homemade um, tomato soup so this would be really nice to do that I can do my uh, frozen smoothie drinks that's cool the dough button and how medium high I can pulse um, my blend and not sure what these two are so I'll find out as we go along here so let's move on. 
Let's see what's in this. Sorry. I know it's moving a lot. So let's see what's in these boxes. So. It. Okay, so this one is the food processor. So that's what that looks like. Um, comes with the blade in there. And let's see what else is in here. Um, that's also an extra blade. So we'll keep going. Oh, this one seems much easier. So what is in here? Let's find out. Um, that's the lid. I think that's probably for the blender. I'm excited. It says, caution, open with care. Contains loose, sharp blades. Put jar upright before removing fan. Oh, okay. Hopefully this is upright. Doesn't really stay on the... Nope, wrong way. You really should have an air point to which way upright, I guess. Especially doing this by myself. Oh, there it goes. That's it's a obviously you guys can read. So I don't need it. I don't need to repeat that. So let's see if I can slip that on. That's just a box. Oh wow, check those blades out. I'm excited. Super, super excited. Um, you know, normally I just would have my fruit processor and my blender. So, you know, I had multiple appliances and I just lately moved. So the house I'm currently in has one counter. I'm really sad about that. So I'm trying, my kitchen is really small. Don't really like that at all whatsoever. My um, previous house loved the kitchen, it was much bigger. So I'm trying to figure out, you know, how to um, utilize the small space. So I think this would really help me because it has multiple appliances in one. So I only have to have one appliance on my counter. So, totally excited about that. Oh, okay. So, this is the individual size. Sorry. My hands is in the way. I'm trying to get out the individual size. The individual size. Oh, my gosh. Okay, let me try to take out this. This is the lid. All these cards. They really pack this really well I can say that um, um, another lid and this is the face for the juice I'm not sure what is this it feels rubbery <laughs> oh Okay, it just says Nurture Ninja on it, so I have to read the instruction book and see what that is. I'm not sure, or maybe they go around the cup. Does it look? No, I'm not sure. So that, there's a couple of those. Let's see, there's one. Maybe that is the to go around the cup because these can be like individualized cups. I think it's like to go. You can get these to go. So maybe that's what those are. I have to read the book and see what exactly those are. Um, the lids. Let's try to get all these off. And, then if, and I believe these are also dishwasher safe. Um, like I said, my kitchen's really small, so I 
I do have a, kish, a dishwasher, but it's currently in my basement because I don't have a space at this house for it. So I'm really sad. I'm doing dishes by myself. And, um, so that's sad. <laughs> so I am eventually going to make a video of me using uh, my blender um, and all these additional equipments. So I'll keep you updated on my ninja blender with the auto iq so if you have any suggestions um on what i should be um using this with please leave me a recipe or give me ideas i would love to really see what this can really do um, most of the time I use my blender for smoothies and drink like that. I have an immersion blender that I was using for my soups. But if I can do that in here, you know, that would be really nice. I would cut down some more work or maybe the immersion blender is better for soups. I'm not sure yet. So anyway, thanks for watching. Um, I'm excited about my new um, toy. I'm ready to get into the kitchen and see what that's like. Um, like I said, leave me ideas. Uh, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy. Bye. Till next time.